using napkins to make beautiful embellishments for our journals. We will make these two. Stay tuned. Hi everybody, it's Julie and I am here with using napkins in your journal. So this is our mini challenge in the challenge number three for the August Alter Junk Journal Challenge. And you can find the details in this video. So we are going to use a napkin and we're gonna decorate four different things using the napkin. So one of the things that you wanna remember is your napkin is probably two or three ply. And we're just gonna go ahead and separate it. Might need tape, okay? So this one is three ply, so I'm going to go ahead and use the tape to hopefully pull up a ply, pull it off, and then come in and pull off another one. I do have decorative napkins in my Etsy shop, and so you can check that out. I have a couple different variety packs. And so anyway, here we go. We have this beautiful napkin, and I'm going to first, I'm going to um, add, put our little bird on one of the covers here. Okay. We put them on this. Okay, so we're gonna rip. That's you know how I like to do things. So I'm gonna rip around him. And I'm gonna keep the flower. I think it's kind of pretty. That's me, my bird. I'm gonna go ahead and take some more off. Okay, now what I'm gonna do is what I call dry emboss. I'm not gonna use Mod Podge. You can use Mod Podge in your, um, for your pieces of the mini challenge and the challenge. So what you're gonna do, you're gonna use napkins and you're gonna make four items. Um, and four different items using napkins and because uh, I, I really would like to see people get to see other people's ideas for this challenge okay so um, you'll want to place your entry in the August Altered Junk Journal Challenge. Your okay, so this is this is going to be one of mine, and of course, you can come back and decorate it more if you want to. And I have done it so that it this is going to slide onto my journal in this direction, okay. Okay, so there's that one, and of course I'm going to probably come back and do some other things to it, but for right now we'll leave it at the... I'm not going to do anything with that right now. So I have this little tag. Um, let's see, there's this pretty little piece that is this little branch that is falling off. Again, I am choosing to rip mine. Okay. And then I'm just going to come and put this on here. Again, I'm going to be doing what I call, well, it's dry decoupage. Okay. Okay, so there we have another 
beautiful little image. Now you can go ahead and add other things. Of course, um, this time I'm making it very simple and you just have to somehow use your um, napkin on four different items. Okay, so there's that. Um, so here I have taken some packaging and I've put one of the panels, so the panel like this, on it. And then after it went, I just cut around it. Okay, so that gives you that idea. Um, this one's just another one of those. And this one in the journal, it actually ends up upside down. So that gives you another way. Here's my other bird that I had done earlier. And then I took a part from here. And that's there. And this is a bird cut out of the, the magazine that I've been playing with. I, I'm going to do a couple more and show you. These are the ones I have already done. So this is a little flip. Here, this one has a couple of the top pieces. And, okay. And... here with the word and here on the yellow paper underneath the calendar page and here so that gives you some ideas on using napkins in your journal and I cannot wait to see what you do so find something to celebrate every day I will put some other embellishment videos in the description box down below. Have a great day. Bye. Okay, and then on to the couple that we're going to go ahead and make. Um, so I have already got a bird ready. So we can go ahead and put him on. And I'm looking, eyeing it, and going, I dropped my, dropped my glue. Okay. So the glue needs to be along his body. I'll go around the top up here. Around the edge where the flower is. And down at the bottom. Okay. That's our little, okay, and I'm just going to line them up, okay, so there's that, turn it over and cut it, okay, and then I have some other pieces from the items that we've been using. So I have a piece of the magazine, a piece of scrap, one of the flowers from the flower paper, and a word. Okay, so we're just going to collage that on top of the napkin giving us a finished all of these together will give us a finished tag that will then match the rest of our journal. So I'm just going around the outside of each of these items. I want the green with the flower and I'm going to use this down at the bottom to kind of make it down at the bottom. Okay, then we have our little flower. And 
this way we bring in all the colors. I'm sorry about the shadows. I'm trying to film when I get a minute when somebody else can be with my dad. <laughs> so there we go. So there's our tag. We've used the bird. And now let's do another tag. We have um, one of the, there was a die cut set that I had that we're using. And we have the, that, and then we have this cute little image from the magazine. And we have this piece of napkin. Okay. So, how can we... Put all of these images on here. Okay. Some glue. Glue down. that up. I'm going to line it up with the side. Okay. And then next I'm going to put this and I'm going to have it come down a little bit. So we're collaging. This is from the the other book part of um, what I'm using in my my challenge okay there weren't any bird words in my crosswords that I had this time so And then we'll go around the outside of this like we've been doing. And then I'm going to show you I've already added a couple of pieces of napkin into my journal. So we'll show you that as well. Okay. So mini challenge and then challenge number three, you're going to use a napkin and make four, use it on four different embellishments for, um, for a project. It doesn't have to be for your uh, mini journal in the journal, or by mini journal, it does not have to be for your August journal, your August altered junk journal. If you're not participating in that, you can still participate in the mini challenges. And you, the, the, we'll pick one winner and they will receive the summer one sheet. Let's just do, oh happy day. Should we put that up there? No, I like it down here. Okay, so this is our using napkins, and let's see, find you the other, there's several places I've already used napkins in, in here, here we've got it on this right here. And here with the word and here on the yellow paper underneath the calendar page and here. So that gives you some ideas on using napkins in your journal and I cannot wait to see what you do. So. Find something to celebrate every day. I will put some other embellishment videos in the description box down below. Have a great day. Bye.